Metanephric adenoma is a benign renal neoplasm composed of small primitive cells resembling early metanephric tubular differentiation. Here we have the normal kidney parenchyma, and here we have a part of the well-circumscribed lesion. The dark blue basophilic appearance on the low magnification is quite characteristic. So all of these cells have very little amount of cytoplasm, so we mostly see the nuclei, and that's why it is characteristic, uh, characteristically basophilic and dark blue. On the higher magnification, we can see that the tumor is characteristically composed of tightly packed small tubules, which are separated by just a small amount of posicellular cellular or acellular stroma. The nuclei of the cells um, are very uniform, usually round to oval shaped. Sometimes we can see nuclear overlapping. Nucleoli are inconspicuous or not visible at all, and mitotic activity is very low. Sometimes we can see branching tubules or even something that looks like a glomerulation. Here we have another example, or here's, well, mostly tightly packed small tubules, and here we have slightly larger branching tubules and posicellular or acellular eosinophilic stroma. The cells are actually very small and they slightly look like lymphocytes, except for the tubular formation, of course. The differential diagnosis includes papillary renal cell carcinoma, especially in cases with fibrous pseudocapsule. And that's what we see here, for example. But there are no papillary formations in this case, so this is clearly metanephric adenoma and not papillary carcinoma. Another important differential diagnosis is epithelial predominant Wilms tumor. Well, sometimes the primitive blastemal component or and stromal component in the Wilms tumor uh, could be inconspicuous, uh, but uh, in this case we don't see it. So uh, this is metanephric adenoma. Thanks for watching.